Olympia Fulvia Morata in Cicerones Paradoxa, Episode 1. This is the front page of the work we will be using. Olympiae, Fulviae, Moratae, Foiminae, Doctissimae, Ac Plane de Winae, Opera Omnia Cum, Eruditorum Testimoniis. So what we have here are genitives, Olympiae, feminine, singular, and genitive, as are Fulviae and Moratae. So, of Olympia, Fulvia, Morata, Foiminae, Doctissimae, the most learned woman, and, clearly, divine, Ac Duinae, this is an excessive compliment, Duinae, Opera Omnia. Opera Omnia is neuter, plural, and nominative. It's the subject. So these are the combined works, or these are all of the works, all of the opera of Olympia Fulvia Morata, the most learned woman and nearly or plainly clearly divine. Together with cum eruditorum testimoniis, along with, this is the preposition cum, it takes always and only the ablative, testimoniis is neuter, plural, and ablative, along with the testimonials, along with the learned recommendations, eruditorum, of educated men, of the educated. Eruditorum is masculine, plural, and genitive. So this means that the work contains a number of endorsements by learned men. This portion contains a description of the remaining contents, not all of which are by Morata. And here we have publication information. It was published at Basil. So Basilii is feminine, singular, and it's a locative, the case which indicates location. Published at Basil, ex officina from the offices or from the shop of Petri Pernai, Peter Perna, or Peter Ham. And the date of publication is 1580.